Hello, I'm Christine Stratton, President and CEO of NRPA. This week we celebrated the 50th anniversary of Earth Day, although not in the way many of us had hoped. At NRPA headquarters, we too missed out on our usual Earth Week activities of planting trees and volunteering at a nearby nature preserve. We did celebrate though by highlighting all of the ways that you continued your own Earth Day celebrations we saw things like virtual campouts, tips from horticulturalists, nature center live streams, self-led bio blitzes, seedling and tree giveaways, nature selfie contests, and so much more. We hope that people who are turning to their parks for much needed solace during the pandemic will become stewards and champions for their local parks as we move into recovery. Speaking of recovery, we know that many of you have questions about when and how your parks and facilities are going to reopen. According to this week's snapshot survey, most agencies, four out of five, are in holding patterns with their summer pools and summer camp plans, awaiting further guidance. Very few have canceled their summer programming options thus far, less than 10% reporting that they've closed and canceled their summer programs. Roughly half of agencies are working on their reopening plans and another 40% report that they'll be starting that process soon. By May 1st, we will have the first in a series of resources to help you on the path to recovery. We are prioritizing the launch of a risk assessment tool that will guide you through key questions that should be answered and plans that should be in place prior to reopening in accordance with public health guidance. This tool will also help you identify which spaces, facilities, and programs are ready to reopen in a phased approach, and which spaces will need additional time and preparations prior to reopening. In addition to the risk assessment tool, we will also have guidance around communications plans, staff training and protective measures, cleaning and disinfection, contracts, vendor relationships, emergency plans, and more. We will share more updates on these resources as they become available. And as always, NRPA is here for you. So please let us know what you need and how we can help. Lean on us, we've got your back. As always, stay healthy, stay safe, and be well.